In our last video, I made a point of saying that I am extra. And that's very true because I like to go above and beyond just the norm. But it also applies to our life in general. Everything that happens is usually bigger or more than just the normal thing that you would expect. And so this morning I wake up and look outside and lo and behold, my recently deceased mother's car has been squashed by a tree. So when I say we do the most around here, I am really not kidding at all. For those of you tuning in for the first time, I'm Erica, and for those of you returning, welcome back. Greg and I raise and breed Connie Corsos, French Bulldogs, Great Pyrenees, goats, chickens, ducks, and rabbits, all on our homestead property. We are proud homesteaders and preppers building a life and legacy of self-sufficiency. Don't forget, you can find us on our second YouTube channel called 12TK Behind the Scenes on Instagram, Facebook, and now we're even on TikTok. So when we're away, you can always find our updates. But before we continue, please take a moment to subscribe to our channel and hit that like button. It really helps our channel grow and it will allow us time to make even more of these videos. So it's morning and I'm out here with Caesar and Farouk's puppies. Just finished cleaning up. They had breakfast. Their bellies are pretty full. And I've been watching each and every one of them poop. This is the time right after they eat, they have to poop. And I wanna make sure that if they have any runny stools that I can catch it and treat them for parasites. And so I need to know if there is runny, runny stool, who's producing it. Either way, you treat the entire litter. But um, I've monitored everyone's poop and now they are all settling in. I have this little travel kennel and sometimes they go in there and huddle up, but I put <laughs> this cat bed out here and they love to squeeze themselves into it. Look at that. They're so cute. Somehow they make it work. It's six of them. Right now it's four. <laughs> you got Dizzy on top. 
<laughs> you got Axl Rose. You got Welcome to the Jungle. You got Solly or Slash. Oh, yeah, this is the Guns N' Roses leather. I forgot to mention that. <laughs> hey, what you doing? What you doing? Your peeps are over here. Now, let's see if they're going to try to get another one in. Solly's going to try. I don't think that's a good way to try. Maybe you should go around the front. Yeah, let's see if he's going to make it. Will he make it, folks? Will he get himself and all that belly up on there? Will it work, folks? I'm watching you, Sully. They're getting squished. You're missing out because you were playing. You were playing. Mm-hmm. You were over here doing this stuff. This is Sweet Child O' Mine. Just call her Sweet or Sweetie. Yeah, Sweetie. Let's go back and see what Sully's up to. He's trying. You just gonna give up and call it quits? What about you? I think he's gonna make it work. Maybe that's it. Should I help him out? I don't know. What are you waiting for, sweetie? Sweetie. Let me help you out a little bit. There, your peeps are over there. That way, you're going the wrong way, sweetie. He's trying, folks. Look at this. Oh, I think he made it. He made it. Oh, okay. Well, not quite. Oop. Well, nothing beats a try but a failure. Oh, come here. Let me help you out. Okay, get him when you can fit him. All right. I helped. I helped him out. Oh, now Sweetie's going to go for the win. I'm not sure what it is about this thing. They have this whole travel carrier. She wants to do it. She's gonna try. Will she make it? I might have to assist. So now there are five puppies in there. We're gonna go for the record if you can make it, sweetie. Look at Axel Rose. Rose is pink collar. Sweetie is purple collar. Welcome to the jungle or welcome. I might just call him jungle because he is wild. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Got a couple buried underneath there somewhere. All right. Sweetie, you gonna try to get back in? If I put you in the back, it might work. Okay, I can help you out. The struggle is real. The struggle is real, y'all. I know, you want me to help you out? Well, if you go back in here, you're not gonna be warm with the rest of them, so. Let's see if I can make this work. Oh. Okay. It's a world record. Six puppies in the cat bed. Now, the question will be, will they be able to get along? Okay, some adjustments are needed. Oh, there's a struggle. Sweetie's not liking her position. She's like, you know what? This might be too much for me. Somebody's got a face full of junk. And sweet, you can't get up there and start biting people. This is not, this was, no, okay, sweetie, you have to get evicted if you're gonna do that. Okay, I had to evict, sweetie. This is not for playing. Looks like Axel Rose is losing her position. Uh-oh, uh -oh, somebody's getting squished, okay. They'll figure it out. Okay, looks, looks like Welcome is has to reposition. Who's back there? Oh, Dizzy. Dizzy's not liking it. Dizzy feels trapped. Okay, Dizzy's like, you know, sweetie, you may have had the right thought all along. I tried to tell you. It wasn't gonna work for me. Okay. 
All right, well, at least for a hot moment, we had six puppies in there. Looks like they've done the Jenga move again. It doesn't look comfortable to me, but maybe, you know, I think Axl Rose is trying to make it work. No? Okay, well. Well. Okay, well. This is about... This doesn't look comfortable. No one looks comfortable here at all. No one looks comfortable. And sweetie, what are you doing? Sweetie's like, I don't know about them bums, but I'm good. Let's check on the, the Jenga pieces. Ooh, the Jenga pieces, they've repositioned now looks like yeah <laughs> oh my goodness solly is doing some type of cirque du soleil move looks like jungles on top and rose is on the bottom okay this is really really interesting okay all right well they're they're making it work okay I suppose um, if Sweetie gets a little cold, she'll figure it out. But it's a little cool in the nursery. Um, this morning it was pretty cold outside when I had Daft. And, uh, and when I say cold, I think it was like uh, mid to low 40s. And so that's cool. It's got a cool breeze in the air. And so, um, yeah, they want it warm. They want it nice and toasty. I don't have the heater on in the nursery because it just, the weather just changed. Hey, shouldn't you be asleep? Oh, now you feel like I need some warmth. Okay, so they're all snuggled in there. Dizzy is literally buried underneath there. This is her right there. I don't even see her face. Let me pan around. Oh, we got some some stuffing coming out. Well, they'll figure it out and they'll shuffle the cards in the deck very often. But yeah, it's a little cool in the nursery. Um I may I'll see how it, you know how warm it gets during the day. I don't want to put the heat on and then as the sun comes up then it gets cold, or sorry, uh, then it gets too warm. And I don't like those wild swings in the temperature, so. All right, guys, um, looks like you guys are good for now. I cleaned up all of your poop. Everyone's doing good. I'll take their nap and I've got to move on. The brakes draw back. Paddock on my wrist, I'ma hit him with a drip drip. They gon' pay the VIP to get a pick with me. I'm a star. Brand new keys to the car. I'm the boss and the king of the czar. Got them so high, so they yeah. The future home of wasabi. So we are at our feed store where we get all of our supplies for the homestead. We get um, our dry kibble here. We do feed raw, but we also have on hand kibble because we like to mix their food. Um, they can't be on 100% raw because there's sometimes when we don't have it available. So we don't want to have their palate to be just uh, raw food. So we'll come here and stock up um, every month on, on kibble. Um, but we also get our goat food and our chicken feed here as well. And you'll see we get other things for our goats like uh, the alfalfa and a lot of hay and shavings. We took all their shavings so they don't have any more of that. But yeah, this is like the normal stuff that we would do 
on a weekend to get all of our supplies. All right, gotta go. Next stop. I know, she does look like she has some home training. <laughs> all right, so that bill today, just turned around, it's backwards. $1,800 and we still didn't get everything. That was just some dog food, some shavings, and not even the full goat food. That's just gonna last a couple days, you know? So, yeah, that was a big one. You gonna help me put all this stuff in here? Or at least sweep? No, not at all. Understandable. As long as you don't mess with my chickens. Cause here they come, being nosy. Thank goodness she doesn't mess with this chickens. Looks good. These chickens gonna have some fresh paint. <laughs> well, no, no, the ducks are going in Oh, here. the ducks. <laughs> the ducks are gonna have, I know my chicken from ducks, but the ducks are gonna have some fresh paint. I still have to get used to the ducks. Time the ducks are not scary. They're not scary, but I am. <laughs> <laughs> so nah, these are going for the ducks and um, the ducks, that's it. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Just the ducks. Yeah. We're gonna try and get this painted by today. We can do it. We can do it. Yeah. Yeah, so, it's not so bad. I mean, just the deck part, that's mm -hmm. all. Not all the railings. Yeah, so we're doing the whole deck, so. Right now it's getting close to time. We'll probably be finished in the next hour. I think so. I think so. Five hours. <laughs> no, no, no. <laughs> this, is not, this is gonna take like an hour. That's it. Yeah. That's it, that's it. Cause it's got to move on to other things. So yeah. Should I, I can ask him a question, right? Yeah. What do you want to ask? How many ducks do you think that she have? That's that's a good question. Yeah. But now we, how would they know though? They would they, have to guess. No, they'll have to take a guess. Uh, so we can do like a range. We well, have to show them the ducks. Right? We have then to probably like show. Them. But then they would. Then they. Then they would know. Uh, let me keep thinking. I'll come back. Okay. Come back. But they have. Okay. So the question is, how many ducks do we have? All mm -hmm. right. Well, let's see. It looks it's lovely. A, it looks it looks great. It looks awesome. It did take an hour, but we're not done within that hour. That's so, true. Yeah, we're stopping before it gets too dark. We're about to get ready to feed the animals and everything. Take a look at the ducks. Can y'all see the ducks? Can anybody give a count by chance of how many ducks? I don't know if they can see all those ducks. But somebody we gotta, can give a guess. Uh, we just see chickens doing it. But, um, <laughs> yeah, no, this looks really good. I mean, this looks... Wow, this looks like somebody's deck. Yes. High, high upper class duck deck. deck. Duck deck, it's a duck deck. Mm -hmm. But it does a little bit look like a boiling pot. Just, just, just a little bit. But when we add the water, 
it's gonna be perfect. So now it's late afternoon and I'm back at the nursery playing with the puppies. Um, this will stimulate them and give them a chance to stretch their legs and socialize. But uh, the day really is only halfway through for us even though it's, it's late afternoon. I'll play with them for a while, clean up, feed them. Then I need to go back out and feed the goats, chickens, ducks, and rabbits. So there's still more to do. Thank you again for tuning in and following us on our journey. If you appreciated the video, leave us a like. Feel free to share your respectful thoughts in the comment section. Don't forget to subscribe and ring that notification bell. And as always, we'll see you in the next video. Now this makes me happy.